I thought it was it was pretty good. Um, you know, kind of like the deal in Midland. I thought it was a step in the right direction. Uh, anytime the offense and the defense is uh, you know exchanging blows and both playing good, that's something that you want to see. Um, but at the same time, we'd like to get a you know faster start on offense, obviously. Um, but I thought we finished well. Talk about a little bit how much uh, Davis has pushed you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, I mean the competition just makes everybody better. Uh, I've said before I'm just using it as a positive tool to keep me going and uh, you know work that much harder. What would you like to see the last three practices plus the spring game on on Saturday just from you? Um, I want to be you know mentally as focused as I possibly can. I think that's the main thing at this point is. Uh, you know, we've, we've made all the throws. We've come out here. We've got the timing. It's just a matter of uh, getting us in the right play, you know, in the right situation and uh, executing the offense. Talk about your excitement for Saturday, the big spring game. It's supposed to be a big crowd on hand. Yeah, uh, I'd imagine it would be a pretty big crowd. It's, you know, it's going to be fun. It's been a while since, uh, since we stepped in front of a crowd like that to play a game. But, uh, you know, it's my third one, third spring game. It's kind of hard to believe, but you know, I'm really looking forward to it. Mike, can you talk about how much fun it is for you to get out there just in the fast break offense and being a quarterback and get to sling it all around the yard? Oh, yeah, it's great. Um, you know, I've been fortunate enough to play in, you know, similar offenses all through high school till now. But, uh, you know, Coach Kingsbury's offense is, you know, it's completely different, you know, in the sense that he gives so much freedom to the quarterback and we play so fast that, you know, it's, it's definitely a quarterback friendly offense and it's a lot of fun to be in. We look at you as kind of the, the veteran mm -hmm. in the quarterback group, but like everybody else, you're pretty much new to all this. Yeah, uh, yeah. Like I said, you know, with my experience playing in offense is similar to this. That's been good. That's helped a lot. But uh, you know, at the same time, it is a new system and it's new terminology, and like, he coaches it different ways. So uh, we're pretty much all new to it. What, what do you think you've learned the most this spring? Um, you know, just self motivation. You know, I, this is kind of the first time that I've ever been in you know, a true quarterback battle and, uh, you know, just being able to wake up and motivate myself to come out and, you know, outwork everybody is, you know, that's that's kind of what I've learned. Like, what, is, uh, what does LaRaven mean to have a guy of his talent and his caliber on the left side of the line for you? Oh, that's huge. You know, anytime you get a guy like LaRaven anywhere on the line, uh, you know, that's that's a big asset. But, you know, to have him at left tackle, that's he's going to do really well. He did really well last year at guard and, uh, you know, the transition from him to guard to tackles, you know, it's gone over real smooth and he's picking it up nicely. With uh, you know Ward and, and uh, Bradley out and Javon kind of missing some time, who's really stepped up for you? Uh, you know, Jakeem Grant and Jason Morrow, obviously, you know, you've seen what they can do last year, and uh, you know they've kind of stepped up and you know taken taken upon that leadership role while those guys are out, and uh, you know they've had really good spring. So I'd like to see them, you know, keep it up and finish it strong.